Kim, can you give me a review of the new chicken feeders? So let's turn this PVC pipe into some chicken feeders. Let me show you. I would like to make three feeders out of this. So we have 120 inches. Now we just need to divide that by three. Now I need to find my hacksaw. We need to look in here. We are so organized, it's just so easy to find things. Haha. -ha. <laughs> and the reason why Zach couldn't find this is because it was put away. There you go. You gotta keep it in the groove. There you go. It's going down. Yeah. Okay, wash your fingers. We don't want to cut your fingers. Okay, so we got them all cut. I ended up cutting the last cut with just the miter saw. So, let me show you what we're gonna do next. Okay, so we got two of these, well, three sets of these. These are two elbows. And here is our goal. We're gonna put this on here so that when this stands upright, I'm gonna attach it to the side of the chicken coop and fill it with food. The little chickens can peck their head in there and this will auto fill till <clears throat> it needs more. Here Finley, will you hold that? Let me show you what I got to stop it with. So I just got these plastic things. I didn't do anything special because they fit in there just fine. And, then how and I can pull it out. Them it works? Should okay. we show them the way it works? Okay. Yeah. Is there a cup in the chicken food? No. Okay. I can use my hands. Okay, you can use your hands. Okay, so the chicken food's gonna go in there. And then. Huh, where's the chicken food? It came out. It all came out? It's right there. What? Oh my gosh. Okay, try it again. Let's see what happens. Oh no! Oh no! Well, Finley, we're gonna have to go back to the drawing board. Why? It doesn't work. We need a better way. Unless we, maybe if we it comes out. angle it, it comes, it comes out. out. Yeah, but on the ground. We want to have it so it stays in the bottom. So we might need uh, some different angle. Here's our prototype. I ended up just switching the bottom around and we stopped the bottom and when we fill it because so it doesn't shoot out. So maybe once it's done raining, these chickens will come and test it out before we install it in the coop. Okay guys, so I've installed the chicken feeders that we made and they've been using them now for about four or five days. So let's go check on the girls and see how they like them. Okay, so I put two here and one here. I propped them up because I realized that on ground level were too low for them. And I don't know if you can see all this, but that's feed all over the ground. So the big chickens will get in here and then fling it all out onto the ground. But they do hold a couple days worth of food. So I think I want to go back to the drawing board and rethink them so we don't have so much waste on the ground. Um, excuse me, ladies, can I get an interview? Um, can I, what about you? Can I get an interview from you? How do you like the new feeder? One, two, five stars? No? Decline to comment? So I would love to see your ideas. If you have an idea of how you can use this PVC pipe, for chicken feeders where I don't have to feed them every day, please send them to me. I would love to look them over, something simple. Um, kind of have an idea in my head, but I would love to know what you all think. Have a great day, bye.